Fox and the Knicks tonight. Jeremy Lin out of commission for the moment because of a right knee. More serious news from New York. Amari Stoudemire was out tonight and could be out much longer due to a bulging disc in his back. So shorthanded, Carmelo and the guys taking on a Milwaukee team in the rearview mirror for the eighth spot in the East. Tyson Chandler, the touch pass to Landry Fields. Here's Mello running the floor. Baron Davis hits him. What a key pass by Chandler, though. Gets the rebound over the head pass, three-quarter court to Baron Davis, and the Knicks out in transition. Early Junior. on, Mike Dunleavy Jr. had it going. He finished with 26 on the night. 14 of those came in a four-minute span. Pano Udrich. Oh, tough shot through traffic, through the contact. Yep, spin cycle here. Bena Udra getting back to his strong hand, which is his left hand, and finishes over Chandler. Did we say it. Junior? You can say it again. Junior! <laughs> say it as often as you like. <laughs> Hit he the was corner to me there. Davis turns it over on the break. Brandon Jennings to Junior. There you go. 12 0 run by the Bucks. 10 from Junior. Thank you. Dunleavy with 26. Third quarter. Nobody hitting anything. Montalis, no. 2 of 14. Out. You the know game. what, Matt, as we watch Jennings here on the break, it, it was a really not a pretty basketball game. Bucks 36%, Knicks 35%, 19 turnovers for the Bucks, 23 for the Knicks. So not, not pretty. The Bucks kind of want to play a little ugly. Maybe they, not that ugly. They, right, not that they ugly. do, but neither one of these teams very sharp tonight. And you know, lots of reasons why. Knicks having guys out, Jeremy Lin and Amari out, and then the Bucks having to deal with Monte Ellis. How is he going to assimilate to this offense? Still trying to figure that out. But when you're a jump shooting team, you can have nights like this. Couldn't hit the open jumper there. 6 0 run by the Bucks. They get it to within four. Mello to Iman Shumpert. The Knicks took 31 three point attempts. Wow. Hit seven of them. Both teams want 25% for the Bucks and 22% from three-point line for the Knicks. So, again, tough shooting night, mellow down the stretch, and there's a little breathing room by that Shumper three. And the Knicks needed that against the Bucks.